Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. A couple of days ago, I posted a video that recent reports had suggested that Microsoft is working on a redesign of the Edge browser, codenamed Project Phoenix. And this Project Phoenix is going, basically going to uh, redesign the browser in different aspects, and it's going to differentiate, according to reports, Edge from other browsers, which will include a new user interface to match the look and feel more of that of Windows 11. Now, I'll leave a link to that video in the description. But just to do a quick update regarding Project Phoenix, and uh, um, for the first time now, we are actually getting to know directly from Microsoft that a so-called Project Phoenix actually exists. So this is basically confirming um, the so-called rumors regarding Microsoft Edge and the project codenamed Phoenix. Now, um, in Edge Canary version 112, which is the latest preview version of the browser, if we head up to the address bar and we just enter about colon forward slash forward slash version. This takes us over to the about version page in Edge Canary version 112, where we get a whole lot of different details regarding this browser. Now, here you can see under the command line flags, just to bring your attention to this text, it says here, MS Phoenix show containers in Edge. So that's the first time now that we are actually um, hearing from Microsoft and getting to know directly from Microsoft that the project Phoenix Phoenix actually exists, where pre previously um, there were just suggestions, but now we actually find this buried in the actual version page um, of the Edge Canary browser version 112, where MS Phoenix show containers in Edge now exists. Now, what this is basically all about is this is going to be a flag that will enable rounded corners around the browser frames. Now, um, I did post on this actually just a couple of days ago. But if we head back to the address bar, and this time we enter edge colon forward slash forward slash flags, this is going to take us over to the experimental flags page. And if we type in rounded, and this is going to bring up a flag called Microsoft Edge Rounded Corners. Now, as I did mention uh, previously, it enables rounded tabs, rounded corners around browser frames that bring visual separation. Now, just to demonstrate what this is all about, because the flag, although it's enabled, currently in Edge Canary isn't actually working. So if we just head over to a website, what this is actually going to do, um, it's going to bring um, rounded frames to the actual browser. So when you head over to a website, those frames are actually going to be rounded, just bringing a more fluent design once again. And that's why at this stage that flag doesn't work because according to um, this text found in Edge Canary version 112. This is the flag that's actually going to replace that and bring those rounded corners around the browser frame. So that's just one of the features we are expecting to roll out with Project Phoenix. Now, just to do a quick recap, another big feature, as I've mentioned previously, is the actual um, split window where you can open up more tabs in one window. So in this case, you can open up a couple of different tabs in one window, which I think is a great move in the right direction. And as mentioned, it's going to just bring features like um, round corners around browser frames, um, a new tab activity center, and just a fresh look that matches the design of Windows 11. So those are just a couple of new features we can expect uh, to see roll out uh, in Project Phoenix. And was just wanting to bring your attention that that um, flag is buried deep in the actual browser and could be rolling out shortly to Edge Canary where it could start it to be tested officially. And obviously with this um, Project Phoenix, as I get more info, I will uh, post and let you know accordingly. And just another sign, as I have mentioned, that um, Edge is literally becoming its own operating system. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.